Hello Project Zomboid survivors, I am back with another tutorial on how to perform simple mechanics that don't seem so simple when using a game controller in Project Zomboid. My preference is the PS4 controller, however I assume if you're using the Xbox controller, this information also applies. Let's talk moving items. This can include chairs, tables, curtains, water dispensers, etc, etc. Once you master this simple task, you will have so much more fun decorating and placing items in your base. In some cases, being able to place items in front of doors, for instance, might act as a temporary defense from your imminent death. So I'm going to go through a few different types of items as there can be some tricky movements involved. If you'd like to jump ahead to a specific item, please see the chapter links in the description below. Let's start off with an office desk. This furniture is in two pieces, requiring you to move separately. To move this item, you first need to select the pick up icon on the left hand side of the screen. I use my mouse for this, I have no idea how to use the controller to select it. Once you've selected pick up, a green tile outline appears and this can be moved around by hitting the directional buttons on the controller. You will move the tile in whatever direction the item is located until it is selected and an information window appears with the item you'd like to move. The window will also have some information on that item. Many items, not all, require you to have certain skill levels in carpentry, electrician, etc. to move them. In this window, you can see you do require a certain level in carpentry and also need to possess certain tools. My character is good to go with all of this, so let's just hit the X button to pick up and place in our inventory. Now be mindful, these items are heavy and you will be encumbered. Walk over to wherever you'd like to place this item. I'm going for the main door here and select the place icon on the left hand side of your screen. The item will appear and you will again hit the directional buttons on your controller to select the area you want to place your item. Once you are happy with the tile location, just hit X again and the item will be placed. One other bit of information, items can't be moved if they have stuff and things inside them. You will have to empty the item before being able to move it. All right, let's talk tables, because it took me a while to figure this one out. For some reason, these large tables as seen here in the kitchen of the firehouse in Rosewood can't be picked up as one piece. Here you can see I select the pick up button on the left hand side, use my directional buttons on the controller to select the table, then hit X, and instead of going right into my inventory, it becomes two pieces of wood on the ground. For this, I've discovered you just have to put one of these pieces of wood into your inventory, then either hit place item from the left side icon, or you can right click it from inside your inventory and hit place item. Once your water is shut off, it can be nice to have these water dispensers in your base. I also think they look really cool. To pick up the water dispenser, just select the pick up icon from the left hand side of the screen. Use your directional buttons on the controller to select it you will see the information window appear with the water dispenser on it. Then hit X and the item will go into your inventory. Again, be mindful that this will encumber you. Next, head to the location you'd like to place it. Then select place and use the directional buttons on the controller to select your spot. Once you like the location, hit the X button again and the dispenser will be placed. In this instance, it isn't facing how I'd like it. So I'm going to select the rotate icon on the left hand side of the screen, then hit the R1 key on the controller to rotate it until I like how it looks. And now you have a water dispenser wherever you want it. Lastly, I really hate having my windows covered up with a sheet. That look just isn't appealing to me and when the world has gone to crap, I want something nice to look at. Instead of hanging sheets over the windows, you have the option of moving curtains from other homes and placing them on your windows. All you have to do is find the curtain of your liking and select pick up from the left hand side of the screen and using the directional buttons on your controller select the tile with the curtain an information window will appear showing the curtain then hit x and then the curtain will go into your inventory you can grab multiple curtains but again you might get encumbered head to the window you'd like to cover and right click the curtain in your inventory and select place it should place it over the window however if it doesn't you can use the directional buttons on your controller to move it to the right location. Then hit X to place them. Make sure you close them so zombies don't see you. 
This concludes my video on moving items and projects on board using a controller. I hope this was useful to you and helps you enjoy this amazing game even more. Stay tuned for future videos on additional controller related topics. If you would like me to make a video on other specific controller mechanics in Project Zomboid, please comment below. And if I know how to do it, I will make a video. If you stuck me to the end, that means you probably liked the video, so go ahead and hit the like button. Also consider subscribing and join my crazy camp. Thank you to my new and current subscribers, and as always, until next time, bye for now.